deep shot, first play. You think they do it? I'd like to see us take a deep shot deep on the first one. <laughs> back, back to you, boys. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you very much. Jabril Peppers on the return. Makes a nice move and gets it up to the 29-yard line. So the Browns offense, led by Tyrod Taylor, will go into business first and 10 at the 29. Do you think we see a deep shot on the first play? Well, if Bernie's the offensive coordinator, we definitely are. <laughs> I, I like your style, Bernie. I, I would like to see that, too. But, uh, you know, Tyrod's a guy that, uh, you know, John Dorsey went out and handpicked as his veteran uh, quarterback to go in to lead this team. And Tyrod has proven that he can take a football team to the playoffs, as he did last year with Buffalo. And uh, he's been a great leader and been ad as advertised so far in training camp. Well, you see Tyrod's numbers there, 19 career interceptions last season. The Browns quarterbacks threw 20. For a season. Deep full throw down the middle, and it is completed to who else but Jarvis Landry. <laughs> Bernie Kosar, you have a future as an offensive coordinator. A great call, Bernie. A great throw and catch by Tyrod Taylor and Jarvis Landry. You see the one on one action. It's actually really good coverage, but a great throw to the back shoulder. Jarvis makes an adjustment on the football as he's been doing all of training camp. He's made a ton of these type of plays, and uh, he's just continuing where he picked off in camp. Well, 31 yards on the completion. There was a flag on the play, and the officials are huddling now to discuss. So Tyrod again, first and 10, back to throw, finds again Landry over the middle, a pickup of about five yards. And I think that's gonna be a theme this year, Tyrod to Jarvis. I think there's some chemistry there. You know, these guys have, uh, they've, they've looked great in training camp and they've been, they've been on the same page and uh, they're, they're just gonna do it uh, here in this first preseason game as well. well Joel. Tyrod to throw. Makes a nice move to buy some time, but will not be enough to get to a first down. Sliding down at the 49-yard line. And that'll Let's bring up. The pace. Kind of get going. You, you know, you want to see this first team unit go and get some points on the board. And to speed things up a little bit, I think, is a nice change of pace early on in this game. Nice comeback route right there. The pass completed to Richard Higgins. will have an amplified role in this Browns offense. I think regardless of what happens with Josh Gordon, Antonio Callaway, the coaches have been very impressed with the young man in practice. Beautiful throw right there on the comeback, and it's a pickup for Richard Higgins of more than 20 yards, and now the Browns getting a little bit of rhythm to that offense, Tim, going to the no-huddle offense, the hurry-up, working very well for Tyron. Yeah, it looks good right now. They've got the New York Giants defense on their heels. Another throw to David Njoku, who finds the end zone for the Browns' first touchdown of the 2018 preseason. What a drive and what a throw by Tyrod Taylor. 36 yards, four plays on the drive, and Taylor looked like a surgeon, Tim. Well, he looked good on that drive, and I love the decision by offensive coordinator Todd Haley to speed things up, change the pace of this game, and Tyrod came out and delivered some dimes. That throw was right on the money, and that's a great sign for Browns fans to see. Tight end David Njoku making plays.